the meat industry is concerned that consumers might be wary of meat sprayed with bacteria-eating viruses. Consumer acceptance of bacteriophage usage may present something of a challenge to the food industry. If they think they're going to have consumer acceptance issues with spreading viruses on meat, that's nothing compared to an even more novel technique to preserve meat, the effect of extracted house fly pupae peptide mixture on chilled pork preservation. Yes, that's what you think it means you smear a maggot mixture on the meat. It is considered a low-cost and simple method. Think about it. Maggots thrive on rotting meat, yet there have been no reports that housefly larvae have any serious diseases, indicating that they have a strong immune system. They must be packed with some sort of antibacterial properties, otherwise they'd get infected and die themselves. So they took maggots who were three days old, washed them, dried them, toweled them off, put them through a blender, filtered out the solids, and voila! The housefly can easily be produced on a large scale with simple techniques at a low cost. And the best part? After the extraction of the housefly pupae peptide mixture, the maggot remains can be used as protein foodstuffs, thereby increasing our protein supply. It's a win-win.